Hey, how are you? Today on Bull That's Weird, we're going to be completing my amphibian trilogy. You know, I've had bullfrog, which was delicious. Yep, that's a meaty frog. He's you chubby. I've had snake, which was surprisingly delicious. This tastes like a, like a chicken wing. And today we try turtle. Whoa, whoa, that's weird. They just plopped one on the table. I assume they're going to prepare it at some point. Is this a soft shell turtle? Wow. You just cook this however you think will be the most delicious. So, I just... Oh, wow. I don't really know what's going on here. I think they're gonna boil them like a lobster, I don't know. Oh, sorry. Oh my god. Just fucking. You could have killed it first. So now they're just chopping the yugwe, the turtle, into uh, bite sized morsels. And then I think they put it in like a stew. I did not need to see how they killed that thing. That was brutal. Kind of takes the fun out of eating turtle. All right, one turtle paw. Everybody knows the rules. Gelatinous. Very gelatinous. Oh, a lot of skin. A lot of small little bones too, I don't know. Not really feeling this. Maybe it's just because I saw how it was killed. I'm gonna need a couple more bites before I get a verdict on turtle. Yeah, that tastes remarkably like toad, but there's more meat on a toad. There's more meat on a snake too. This, I'm just like clawing around all these awkward bones just to get these small little morsels of meat. It's really not worth the bang for your buck. This is just the, this is just the shell. It's weird how like, parts of the shell are hard. You, you hear this? And then parts of the shell are just flabby. Yeah, zero meat on the shell. So what is the point of eating turtles? Fun little side story about turtles in China. My first few years living out here, I would randomly see like a Chinese dude just on the side of the road with a giant turtle tied to a stick. It was the weirdest thing. And so, you know, I was obviously curious. Sometimes I would take out my phone to take a little photo and the people holding the turtles on a stick would just be like, whoa, 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 no, no pictures, no pictures. They would just get like super embarrassed and run away. I was like, dude, if you're standing on the street with a turtle tied to a stick, you gotta expect a couple people are gonna wanna take a picture. I had no idea what was going on, apparently, those are like random construction workers and they find a turtle crossing a road somewhere in China and then they just stand on the road and they're trying to sell it. They're trying to sell it for meat because I, apparently it's a hot commodity out here. I mean, what kind of turtle even is this? That's the problem of um, doing Whoa That's Weirds out in China is that I don't really know enough Chinese to learn too much about the food I'm eating other than the fact that, whoa, that's weird. Oh, there's the head. This is the like, first time I feel kind of sad eating this. I used to have pet turtles, so this is the first time I've pretty much eaten a pet. You know, I never had pet toads, I never had pet snakes, but as a kid I did have a pet turtle and I was really sad when he died. And you know, I kind of just contributed to the death of something I used to love as a child. So this is probably one of the sadder, well that's weirds. Um, and uh, it's definitely not one of the most delicious ones either. All right, well, I guess, uh, you know, I will not be giving turtle my stamp of approval. But then again, you know, I only tried one type of turtle. This is like, whatever, a soft shell river turtle. 
I mean, I have heard snapping turtle is delicious. So if somebody ever offers you that, feel free to give it a go. This, eh, you can pass on. Whoa, that's weird. Whoa, whoa, that's weird. Really fucking weird. Holy fucking shit.